Hey guys, this is Michael from Conquer Chemistry. In this video, we'll be going over a shortcut for calculating the pH of a weak base. This problem asks us to calculate the pH of 0.2 molar C2H5NH2 solution. So we know this is a weak base because, well, it gives us the Kb value. Kb is the base dissociation constant. A strong base will not have a given Kb value. Only weak bases will have a given Kb value. Also, if you see a compound that ends in NH and is neutral, it's most likely going to be a base. The way we're going to approach this is with this shortcut, this equation, that Kb, the base dissociation constant, is this equal x squared divided by the concentration of the base. And then we can solve for x, and that's going to equal the hydroxide concentration, and then we can move on to pOH and pH. Let's see how that applies to this problem. So let's start, start off by setting up the Kb, 5.6 times 10 to negative 4. And that's going to equal x squared divided by the concentration of the base, which in this case is 0 0.20. Concentration is just molarity. Then let's cross multiply. So let's move on to the calculator right here. We'll do 5.6 times 10 to negative 4. We're going to cross multiply by 0.2. And we get that. Then next, after we get rid of the 0.2 by cross multiplying, we're going to take the square root of both sides. And taking the square root of both sides is the same thing as raising the answer that we got to the 0.5 power. And that gives us our x value, that x is equal to 0 0.0105, which is just going to equal the OH concentration. I'm going to go back to full screen. You can see that x equals OH. Now we're going to solve for the POH by taking the negative log of that. So we're going to take the negative log of the concentration of the OH, which is the 0 0.015. 105 and then let's go back to the calculator we're going to do negative log of the answer that we got the 0 0.0105 and that gives us our poh which is 1.98 and then lastly once we have poh we can get ph by just subtracting the poh from 14. so 14 minus our answer and then we do 14 minus answer that gives us a ph of 12 0.02. Let's check if that makes sense. Well, this is a base as indicated by the Kb, and our pH is 12.02, which is above 7, which is basic, so that, that matches up. And that's the shortcut for solving for the Kb, uh, I mean, solving for the pH of weak base. You would just use the expression Kb equals x squared divided by the concentration of the base. Cross multiply this, Let's take the square root, get the x, that's the, o, the hydroxide concentration. Then take the negative log of the x value to get the pOH, and then subtract the pOH from 14 to get the pH. If you want to learn how to ace chemistry, if you want to learn what's the best way to study for this class, if you want to learn some neat tricks and tips to take into your exam and do better on them, then you should head over to my website and get this free guide, uh, 12 Secrets to Ace in Chemistry. You can head over to www.conquerchemistry.com slash chemsecrets. I'm going to include a link in the description below. Check it out. I think it's really going to help you and you're going to you're going to like it. Until next time, keep working hard and continue the good work.